Hi guys, Namaste. Welcome back to our channel. We bring you another video, which is uh, what's it? I think the informative Calco videos. And, uh, yes. Oh, first one. of all, welcome to our nursery. Oh yeah. Welcome to the nursery. Yeah. So nursery ko jan kari ko sasma. How we got it ready, everything. We will come up with a vlog. We are still waiting for a few things to be installed here and there. This was she on in it. Some of the like whatever you can see, I'll get this sneak peek of our nursery. Uh yeah, I'll be here and boy. Why are we here? I don't know. As you can see, we have a lot of newborn essentials. Tapeko baby, tapeko karma. Welcome, gori sakno pa isaki pachi. I think that is one topic that we don't address or speak about that much. I'm depending kasi gori kuch hai na. Oil samat tapeko. Tapeko depending amra videos yeno baako. So it's usually about pregnancy, pregnancy ma kiki unsa first trimester, second trimester, mood swings banyo, ke khane ke na khane vaccination this that. But honestly, we were thinking that you know it's important to even address ki tapeko birth di sakno. We are also very close, very close to that uh, date. Yes, we are very close. Yeah, very close here as well. <laughs> so after you've given birth, say, uh, what to expect when you bring your newborn home? How to take care of a newborn? Newborn, let's say, essentials. So you be say, ma kura kani gorna kulagi, so that all the expecting mothers out there, like me, uh, like ali kati easy os panera. So you jun information some of anga aza. You say compile gorera um, yama Nepal bani yota samsta ononsa. So this is the knowledge hub for new parents, expecting parents, uh, parents to be. So any kind of Even information. Caretakers. Yeah, any kind of information you want to know about newborn care or just in uh, general pregnancy, Yoma Nepal could say more description, Marco website, a description, my into Instagram handle, but you'll see right here. So you can follow the page and get more information. And plus, you can also talk about. Uh how you're going about topic of after pregnancy and you can share it on their blog site and this basically you can stay anonymous also yeah or you can and even you can sign up to their um, newsletter newsletters yeah you can stay connected with them so you have all information in the description box so you can go through that and you can share information here so I think it's a good personal level when I went through this because this is not just oh I'm going to research or google or compile information and this information that we are sharing with you today is actually compiled by Yama Nepal and it's verified by Dr. Smriti Mathima she's a pediatrician Kapunda Medical College so a few points where we'll discuss with you detail ma about uh, you know what to expect after bringing your uh, newborn baby home. Rahamro, you as a co episode like Sahad Dinuboyko, so Yaman Nepal, to Tomari Bani Nehali, plus Hamla Sahad Dinuboyko, so Kiko Nepal, as you can see, they've sent so many amazing stuff for us that will come very handy after our baby is here. Uh, so, as called saying Nepal, my Pani Tapali, it's a very variety of uh, things, essentials, newborn essentials that you need for your kid. Yay, Nepal, my Kinna Pounun, sir, and Kiko Nepal is one of the biggest uh, brands I think that will provide you with so many different options, offers, harik cheese. So you'll be simple as I'm going to Also so, a very good price point. Can you give one of the entry level, the kind of advanced, all the extra features are available right So yeah. that I also realized. And if you have a level of science, you can find the same product in different levels. Okay? Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so we have a lot of things. You can find the same product in different levels. Okay? Okay, so without wasting any more time, we are so excited. Let's waste some time. We are so excited to share <laughs> all this knowledge that I'm living in Bokhar Paiko because mm -hmm. as a new mom to be and a dad to be, like new parents to be, we've realized that we've learned so much from this article that we have and that we're sharing with you guys today. So for new parents and for parents to be. So let's start this. Ready? So handling a newborn baby, you handle कसरी करने वाले र शुरू करने वाले आगरे इस हमी अलग कतियों रा germs और कतियों रा dust particles और इस तो इस तो बोकेर गए रा कुन्जा जून्से हमी पो immune सा new babies और newborn babies और हो दही ना so the first thing we have to do is before we handle a baby we need to make sure our hands are clean and this को लागी चाहे it's best to wash it with soap water soap and water or oily को जमाना में चाहे this is a new revelation for me as well 
baby safe sanitizers when you pawn it is up. So before we carry a newborn baby, okay, all right. So before I talk about anything else, I'm lazy because you know, baby Ako China. We got this little baby doll. Yeah, I'm also in a suit when you so that's the reason why I'm also wearing yellow. Just to show you guys how it is that we've learned to take care of a baby. So it's a type of baby that we have to do. It's best to have guests who are in the house. We have to wear a mask all the time. And before carrying the baby, hand sanitizer is in our hands. We have to wear a mask and wear a mask. We have to wear a mask. We have to wear a mask. So first point for handling a newborn, what we've learned right now is masks always on. Hands always washed, hat dhuni pravidi se namane, sanitizer always on. Iti la tinta se hamri, yad garo so that we don't pass on our germs, whatever we're carrying. Covid the biggest threat by the Covid is always there. I mean, it's there right now, but Covid na bhaku bhai pani. Your steps lina se ekdam is zaruri tha so that you protect your baby from germs and infections. Okay, so moving on. Now we will uh, talk about how to support your baby's head and neck while holding the baby. My baby has never held a newborn baby until today, right? So pan that's why pani this information ekdam e hamla helpful bhai rasa ke. So yeah, ali yad garnu bokola. Newborn ko heaviest part is the head. So tapali baby book the head yad garnu bokola. First few weeks ma they don't know like how where to how to put their heads up, unsa ni? So tele gor da kere se it's our duty when we carry the baby. You make sure ki wah bachar ko neck ko pasari ko jin muscle unsa. That is the critical muscle is not fully developed. So it is very important to always have your hand and support their head and their neck when you carry them. So next one, you say baby ko fontanelle say they are very sensitive and delicate. You you forehead ko your part on sunny. So you have to avoid pressing on it, putting weight on it or giving stress on it. Babies go head say um, shape and be study mold by that one so in the first few weeks so make sure that you avoid pressing too hard scientifically basically when a newborn baby is out the newborn baby ko bones are I'm ready to connect by the boss and especially the newborn baby ko skull junions they're all fragmented bones front and ala set up I go to baby ko skull could say take a take a two gaps or runs it doesn't take them is sensitive so basically a newborn baby is always sensitive so the bones when it up I go fully formed back on then a quarter back on then as an adult does to they can't look at the head or a butt sack with a talk about when they're a force slowing a stress the need to go no then and third part you might be nervous you know because first time handling a newborn baby moment I'm very nervous I've had I've held a lot of babies because my close friends have given birth and stuff only the girl even got it so it's it's okay to be nervous so test to any situation so when it's a according to the article that I've read and any sitting down being comfortable yourself calming yourself down and then taking a baby might actually help rather than so if you are nervous if you are nervous I think at the start of the bus you can just get used to holding your baby get used to being comfortable with managing the weight how to keep your hands how to so if you are doing the baby how to weight how to keep your strength how to keep your strength besides a few times bus if you hold the baby and then if you are very comfortable then maybe you can like walk around with the baby and stuff so that's also another thing that's recommended okay now let's discuss some holding positions so if you are newborn how to hold your baby so we have four positions that we are going to discuss today the first one is going to be the cradle hold so cradle hold one is a newborn's life for several weeks some mama the most comfortable top of the as a parent to hold the baby your baby level need to feel safe and attached to you um when you position also cradle hold much a key girl in some money first time you will put your baby horizontal way man at your chest level so top of the heart like the bottom border was connect some mama slide girl in like janus to support but take a look at the elbow gap mouse go ahead take a part and you like comfortable it had acne and while still cradling the head you can move your hand from the supportive supportive arm to the bottom your heart will be empty and you can do free heart and you can do other things or give extra support to the baby you can get a little bit of a little bit of a little bit so this is one of the safest positions that the baby also feels comfortable and safe this is the cradle position second is the shoulder hold shoulder hold you can get a shoulder is going to be involved so shoulder hold you can get the baby's body like parallel you can get the baby's body like parallel you can get the baby's body lift the head and take the baby to your shoulder keep one hand on their head, neck, and support the baby's bottom. You can 
Oh, the baby can hear your heartbeat. Tapos alam kita mas lang nubo. The baby can look out from on top of your shoulder, look behind you. So this is another very comfortable and safe position uh, to hold your newborn for the first few weeks. The third position now is called the belly hold. Belly hold means you will lay your baby You will lay your baby stomach down across your forearm with the head up towards your elbow. Their feet should land on either side of your hand, angled closer to the ground so the baby is at slight angle. Usko head alikuti mati, kutal kuti tolo. Your position say most effective when your baby has gas, is uh, needs to burp. So tiyo boy ban say pothari bara ulai majali tapali stroke kar din boy bani. You can work out the gas, you can make the baby burp. So this is the third position to holding your baby. It's the belly hold. And the fourth position is the lap hold. Lap hold ko laite tapara chair ma bosnus. Your feet firmly on the ground. This pachi you place your baby in your lap. Tapeko baby ko head say, tapeko knees ma una paryo, knees area ma, face up una paryo. Ani both of your hands say you make sure you place it beneath the baby's body. And then the baby's feet should be tucked in at your waist. So baby like I said, Dahira, you can cradle them, you can talk to them, hat free vibe, you can nudge the baby, play with the baby. So this is another comfortable position that the baby will really enjoy the lap hold. So these are the four positions that Tapa uh, Hai comfortably after baby hold gonna So your newborns like most important Yes, it's your newborn baby. You've been so excited to meet your baby all these months and the baby's finally here. Taratyo excitement ma, please do not shake your baby. Baby la shake garne, hollowne, upharne, newborn baby la sik, please do say no garno la. Do the excitement ko matu kura hai, kare kare cha, abo sano bacha, abo boos dainan, nana, kati umir sama boos dainan, abo baum da paka sa na, abo kunte sti tiyo mana te wera thaza, kare kare te frustration rang, te reach lepani hai na. No kara! Hola, that's the no garum. Because baby could brain bunny damn ready to form bago mudanera. If you shake, shake a baby, yeah. brain damage on socks, brain my bleeding on a socks, which is not good. Yeah, so please never shake your newborn. Okay, moving on, we're going to be talking about breastfeeding now, which is very, very, very important discussion that we need to have. Right? So, breast milk ko baare ma chai, yaha la kati ko jankari chha chai na maana tha chai na maana chai etti dheri jankari thie na bishtit rup ma, jun maali yo article bada porne moka paa hai na. So, tapai ko baby born boy sa ki pashi chai, first phase of milk tun tapai ko niskin cha, tiyo chai alakati yellowish color ko hundo re cha, and that is called a colostrum. So colostrum uh, it will not look completely like milk. It has a very yellowish uh, color to it, you There are misconceptions that milk is It's not good for your baby. When you say that you don't It's a misconception. You may have some clear on that. Because the colostrum that milk that first comes out, this ma iti tiri antibodies unsa, which will help in the development of your baby's immune system. So to say it's a must that you feed to your baby. This pachi bulla milk also. So milk first ma only milk few days pachi colostrum ice ki pachi only milk say it's called the transitional milk. So transitional milk ma say the same amount of antibodies ra, protein jun colostrum ma tyo titi say hude na tyo banda kam unsa. Tara transitional milk ma ki unsa bani it has more lactose, it has more fats and it has more calories which is highly essential for the growth of your baby this was she after 10 to 2 10 days to 2 weeks of your postpartum bachi chai then bolla mature milk also mature milk ko texture se kasto hundo resa bhane it's white tara alikati patolo flowy khali ko might have a bluish tint to it so skim milk so dekhina sakcha haina so your mature uh, milk chai it's packed with all the fat and all the nutrients that your growing baby needs so these three phases of different kinds of milk that you will be introduced to, that I will also be introduced to, uh, post uh, delivery, you say that I lay, jan kai rakhi ya boy mani, it's going to be very very beneficial to you. So okay, breast milk ko ta amle kura kani gori alo mani. So now let's talk about nursing. So baby, how many times do you think that a newborn baby needs to be fed in a day? Eight to ten times. 
that's pretty close. That's actually correct. Eight to twelve times Moili Pai could Zankari Anusar say. Every two to three hours ma a newborn baby needs to be fed because their stomachs are tiny, so easily chito fill on sa and then they will also pee a lot, so easily body work on the skin sa so you have to feed them at least eight to twelve times a day. So if you're exclusively breastfeeding, which I'm planning to do, exclusively breastfeed God on Sabana say, you give your baby the chance to nurse at least 10 to 15 minutes at each breast. Now, we use the term latch. Latching means your baby actually latching onto your nipple. So, suction tap can be used. You can use the breast milk. You can use the gas. You can use the milk supply. milk supply. You can use the milk supply. You know, there are a few techniques. One of the newborn babies. Instinctively, they know how to suck and they know how to latch, you know. But sometimes, say, take position milina, nipple ko position milina, lips ko position milina. But it's saying the latch will take some time. It might take trial and error, a few adjustments here and there. So, aba se hami to a few techniques or dikhonso by which you can make sure that your baby has comfortably latched to your breast. First, how to hold your newborn baby. So, the cradle hold. So, this must say, you lay your baby lengthwise across your abdomen. Use one hand to support his head and the other his bottom. Make sure that you take the baby's lips towards your nipple and help with the latching. So, second is the football hold. Football hold must say, you place the baby beside you face up. Tapi ko arms length man akno isli ay no check ko support liyera akno juma. The baby ko head lies ay guide the head towards your breast. So if you've had a C-section, then you position tapa la chan comfortable umchala maybe while you're trying to breastfeed your baby. And the third one now is the lying down position. Is ko like say both you and the baby needs to be lying down in the bed. Their mouth should be at the same height or maybe slightly lower than your nipples. And with your free hand, you can adjust the baby's mouth towards the nipple. Ulai easy manaidinos and circle your other arm around them and just make sure that they latch. Okay, breastfeeding has several positions. I have to say that 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 I have to his or her heart's content breast suck karna suck dena so it cannot it will not empty out your breast and plus ramu sang latching bhai na bhane chai baby gassy hune clogs hune ule majale afno man bhare ra khana na sakne so you sab issues ra auncha haina so aba latch karna ko lagi chai arko help hune tapai le garna saknu hune bhane ko pillows use garna saknu huncha breast feeding pillows which is all right, so it's the Ramro breastfeeding pillow for hiding the back of the key cool here, right? So using breastfeeding pillows or folded out blankets or towels, you can use all these uh, to make sure that your baby has comfortably latched to your breasts. We'll show you a few techniques of how it can be done. All right, so getting the baby to latch. Abo you say, I'm like, how should I comfortably go on a suction? The most that we can, we'll try to show you, right? So first, mate, baby, lay just put her on her side so that the baby is directly facing you with the belly touching yours, right? Tapa pili pillow use go on a suction, so pillow ko mate baby cha. Don't lean over towards the baby. Tapa yes, the newer aunty, right? That's a no no. You bring up the baby towards your breast. तो अपनी कंफर्टेबल वे में आए उसको मुख सुख थीची नहीं करे अनुवार थीची नहीं करे तीसरी होई ना कंफर्टेबल वे में बेबी को फेस लाइक होल्ड हर अप टू योर ब्रेस्ट तेज पर शी प्लेस योर थंब एंड फिंगर्स अराउंड योर एरियोला देन यू टिल्ट योर बेबीज हेड स्लाइटली एंड फर्स्ट मार्च हैं बेबी को लिप्स ले Tickle your nipple until she opens her mouth wide. Baby ko lips lai ta pali afno nipple ma logera. If you tickle her lips, then ule afno muk bistari kholsa. This but she say gently try to put ta pali ko nipple inside her mouth by placing her lower jaw on first below the nipple. Lower jaw ta pali hali sakno boy say. But she say then usko upper jaw lai pani slowly breast completely bitra zane kari in a very slight. Not aggressive, not painful. Double just the way, na. Make sure that you just slide your nipple inside the baby's mouth, and make sure that the baby takes the entire nipple, at least a little inch of the areola inside her mouth. That should really help with the latching. 
Okay, bonding and soothing. So, have you heard about golden hour bande term, baby? Camera wise, keep. No, no, baby wise. <laughs> <laughs> after baby is born so after baby is born saying the first hour you know say when you are introduced to your baby for the first time there is a golden hour bandar is okay so that is when parents would want to you know do skin to skin and just connect and bond with the baby so bonding is very very important with your newborn and so they like that skin to skin girl you're just holding your baby very close but sala pani diaper mathe lagai dela afu pani mathi bare naked hunchani bhayera say baby like afu skin sang close di rakhnu bhayo bhanche it helps you connect with the baby the baby also feels safe mm-hmm. your emotional connection like any help got there sitting there na so to say not just right after that one hour after the birth that the golden hour one inside na but the next few days when the more you do that the safer and more secure your uh, baby feels okay so that bonding say is very very important so yes, my what you will find me doing that around then So both you like the mother and your partner you can take time and opportunity to be skin to skin with your baby and so you hold your baby like Munagi Banasi this way you will make your baby feel warm you will make your baby feel loved connected safe secure and so so I'm really looking forward to doing that aren't you Hey and so skin to skin the boy and and all go say babies like them react when when it sounds okay so hami early pregnant ko yo ye phase ma pani we've read uh, and we also practice it ki aish likha the he sings to the baby he talks to the baby but i don't know likha se react kar raha hai but we kind of just feel like maybe will react kar raha hai na so sounds is also another important and very um if efficient tool to connect with your baby bond with your baby once the baby is born ama example the jaiban baby like the no man like like bogi ra ko huncha ani connection bhai hal cha na ani afno dad sanga afno bua sanga kasari huncha bhanda khera chai i think me speaking to the stomach ani alikati gum gum gara to sunna tara the voice don putcha bhanera i keep doing that because um with the research ani hamlo yo mala parai din bhako jun doctor le nai bhannu bhako cha tesma chai ke bhannu bhako cha bhani If you keep talking to the baby, singing to the baby, or the infant co hearing co like even you help her sir. And if the baby is a little fussy, but sorry, I'll get the read up, not correct up. You know, like when you distract one or co like, you know, or co like, I'll get the the you babies can't talk, so you know, like the discomfort by like so many, you know, like soothe one or co like. I think singing to the baby and talking or and cooing, poetry and, and cooing, babbling, and cute voices, ma, because. they will react okay? i have yeah. i've seen this with other babies as well yeah. they will react and it it really helps but i think that is what i'm also going to do because will am dheri nai rest gona dina lagako chu ra rock gardai afno lab ma rakhera mathi mero gaming chair ma bosera alikati rock gardai gaundai bosna chai mundai mun cha Okay, in our group, I say you know some babies might actually be very sensitive. You openi mali yai pore thapa ko, you know, so they might be unusually sensitive to touch, light, loud noises, and so ni. So it them start alone, ni. And tili ko dahiri suti ra ko bala mata bali koi koi ko bade kono ni bacha haru. So ko utse ni. So it them sensitive babies are. So this to this to kiss sa, huh? Because they want to. Because they want to start alone. This to if if that's the case. अभी मानेर धे क्लोज कंटैक्ट कर बोलने खोजे अगड़ी बड़े बोलने खोजे मुख लुक आने खोजे सो दे विल गिव साइंस डे के इफ यू बेबी इज वेरी सेंसिटिव हाथ ने छुप्न खोजने सो तस्त के जस्ट यू नो ट्राई टू अडाप्ट टू अकोर्डिंग टू योर बेबीज नीड्स एंड तस्त में किप नोइज इज लो किप लाइट्स अब एकदम ब्राइट न भाई दिन सो यू नो ट्राई टू अडजस्ट टू मेक श्योर दैट योर बेबी इज कम्फर्टेबल सो दैट्स विथ सेंसिटिविटी सो द फोर्थ वन दैट वी गोइंग टॉकिंग अबाउट इज स्वाडलिंग सो स्वाडलिंग इज अनादर वेरी वेरी इंपोर्टेंट कन्सेप्ट Jun say I think all newborn parents Even we're learning now. Yeah, it's a soothing technique that apparently works with a lot of newborn babies mm-hmm. because jun womb bit on your safe comfortable but tucked in where bossy comes and so first of all say they you have feeling say the babies my feeling generate corona sucks like when you uh, swaddle your babies. Now we will show you a video of how to swaddle a baby. With a swaddle. <laughs> yeah. ओके स्वाडलिंग अ बेबी सो जो तब को स्वाडल छे फर्स्ट में वी विल फोल्ड इट इन टू लाइक डायमंड शेप ट्राइंगल ओके बेबी तो ठैक्क टाउ को भाग आप बेबी को सोल्डर को पार्ट में राखे इस टाउ को प्लेस कर फर्स्ट वी गोइंग टू स्वाडल फ्रम दिस साइड सो यो आर्म लाइन मजा विक इन 
Then take the swaddle. Swaddle ko material se flexible khali ko stretchy khali ko nsa. So you take it around. Ra baby light isari tala muni isari wrap karay dimos one side par. Okay. Just because you tala ko jun excess material sa ni. Eleven in liya nsa. You tuck it in here. That's how you turn your baby into a nice comfort burrito. This thing you all go hot level and eat up it up. Do the same with the other side. And then tuck your baby in. And there you go. You've successfully swallowed your baby. Okay, another important thing that we have to talk about is sterilizing the bottles. So Mirabani plan is to exclusively breastfeed my baby as much as possible. <laughs> Then for whatever reasons, it is your sum of boy and if you have to feed through a bottle, formula corner body when say sterilizing the bottle that you use is very, very important. So don't the bottle skin early on, sir. They like saying surumai the palette sterilize gonopar so before you introduce it to your baby. So sterilize gonopar is it there? Two ways of doing it. First is the traditional way, which is mozzale tulo bana ma pani mozzale umaldi ne. Ang tapay ko sa pay bottles, bottles ko parts siro ba yung if your baby is using a pacifier, teeth or jiji use gari dahil ko sa mozzale. Sa pay tayo bitra mozzale haldi ne and you bring the water to a boil. Pash pa yung let everything boil and then after that turn it off. Tongs use gari nus, nikal nus, or safa tal mo rakti nus and let it air dry. Easiest way. But having said that, say different manufacturers have different different guidelines and different criteria. So make sure you check that. Kun products ko kun saman like kati ber bol gona mil sa mil dana. Tujhe lekhi kon sa. So you follow that. That is the traditional borsong borsa dekhin use gari aire ko way of sterilizing your bottles. Awesome. So apa second way se jun sa jun se kiko Nepal le pani provide gari rahin pa ko sa ani, which you can probably see. Right here, mm -hmm. you have a sterile natural three in one one. So, you can see how many layers are. Now, this is the traditional way, but it's a big layer, but it does the same thing in a more efficient manner. So, you can see how the price is definitely a low point. So, it's not a lot of time. Everywhere, you can see boiling water. Time is not a lot of time. Time is not a lot of time. If you have a bottle, you can see the time is not a lot of time. So, if this is not a lot of time, option is more comfortable for you then say I think you should go with this say because hassle-free easy faster so two way my two sous vide as a sterilizer they provide girls the first thing is every time a baby feeds when lights a burp girl on you it means over it's a any kind of thing but I really last one and also get a ramble in a boy run air Intake boy को कारण लेकर आया रे पुनी उन्हर को स्टमक में गैस फॉर्मेशन बॉय को कारण ले उन्हर ले अनकंफर्टेबल बॉय रे आरके ले फसी होना साथ सा सो व्हेन यू सी दैट योर बेबी इज बीइंग अ लिटिल फसी एवरी टाइम यू फीड इट्स इम्पोर्टेंट और इट इज इवन पॉसिबल टू टेक द लैच आउट एंड मेक देम बर्प एंड Fussy boy, oh, it's them. I'm going to tell you, buddy. But boy, not even know. And if they comfortably feed, also say, burping is important. Eh? After your baby has finished feeding, make sure that you burp your burping. baby. Yeah. That also helps with their digestion. Burping is very very important, and there's a few techniques of how you can help to put your baby in a position that the baby will easily burp in. So that's what we're going to show you next. First, hold your baby upright with their head on your shoulder. Support your baby's head and back while gently patting the back with your other hand. So it's in a little pat gori rapnus until you hear the baby burp. This is one of the ways of doing it. Second, sit your baby on your lap. Then support your baby's chest and head with one hand by cradling your baby's chin in the palm of your hand and resting the heel of your hand on your baby's chest. So be careful. Usko chin say grip gono say not the baby's throat. And this but she or ko hat let's say gently pat your baby's back until your baby burps. Okay, third one, lay your baby face down on your lap. This but she baby ko head lies support gonna make sure it's higher than their chest. Okay, I'll be the mati elevate corners ko chest lie and gently pat or rub their back slowly until you can hear your baby burp. 
All right, these are the three ways जो ना हमले provide कर दिए कुछ है ना र इस तो गर्दा गर्दे पनी तभी को baby लिए ये burp गर्दे ना time लियो बने चाहिए you feel free to change different positions के गर्दा गर्दे एक बार position बड़ा start करने उस और को मालूम जान उस तब बड़ा action book आ रही है उस burp गर्दे ना बने and then फिर try doing it again उन से नहीं because your baby should always burp ए ना गाड़ी ना होस्ट छोड़ दूँ सुधार दूँ बने ना करनु यू मेक शुर दैट योर बेबी बर्ब्स बोल इट माइट टेक टाइम इट माइट टेक अ लिटिल एफर्ट बट इट्स टोटली वर्थ इट जब बर्ब गाड़ी सक ने बित्ती के बनी तुरंत ए बर्ब गाड़ी बित्ती के बनी लाइ डाउन सुधार दूँ इस काम पर ना करनु सहना यहाँ लिखी बर्ब गर्ल से क्योंकि एक डेढ़ मिनट एक्शन नोट गर्ल जाने उगा जाने अन्य बल्ला यू प्लेस ए बेबी डैम। All right, that brings us to the last segment of this episode, which is the baby's weight. अब बेबी को वेट में से दस इनफॉरमेशन डेट आई आल्सो फाइनली लर्न्ड टू बिकॉज़ यू मतलब बंद था कि नहीं यू कुछ ऐसे इधर कुत्ती सुनी नहीं हो अन्य तेरे को तो हरे आती नहीं होगी कि उन्हें वो when a newborn is born, basically by the world my ICFC, usually in about um, for a few weeks, say the baby might lose weight. And the reason behind that, ki ho wala ra bojne bala ma chai, jab bata pet bitra honsa, womb bitra honsa, usko jun environment ko lagi us suitable wala bosi honsa, by the world my ICFC say, usko tiyo swell wala bosi raha honsa, raha chai, tiyo swelling, jun sunne wala bosi honsa, tiyo chai kotne ho. So five to ten percent say baby को weight काटने रहे सा, which is not supposed to be alarming और ये काम ने को तो हरी देरे आप और वो देरी जाना आप experience पाको मान चला पनी not हाफ आको बनी उन्नो सक्सर और अन्य कल के over feed पन गानो सक्सर, so there are so many things that we need to focus on and be wise and to actually understand रहे सा, and we're very very grateful for Yama and Dr. Smriti for giving us such wise and helpful information mm -hmm. so yeah last time i had a baby go weight company could have got you yeah and so baby go weight first few weeks ma drop boy when it birth weight but i said no it's not mm -hmm. alarming that is very normal like he uh, said it's swelling going down and it be study after three four weeks the baby starts like mother breastfeed boy say was it be study weight gain by now so so don't be um scared or alarmed because of that so having said that like he said that's the last segment that we're going to be talking about today there's so much more to cover so we'll come back with another video discussing more things um, that you should learn and be aware about once your baby is um, in this world so what you should be expecting or how to take care of a newborn so we'll come back with the second segment uh, very very soon so everybody watching us today whoever tuned in thank you so much i hope you are happy to learn more about this thank you so much Kiko Nepal for uh, being a part of our episode today thank you so much uh, Yama Nepal for giving us all this information and making this experience uh, so special and valuable for us as well especially we are ready to welcome our baby as well I mean, it's just few days, weeks away. So, it was a information hamlet and it's through my pound that he is saying because all the halka bako just to feel back was okay because we know what to expect. So, yeah, information yeah, so many communicate corner cause you got you hamlet. Okay, hot summer. I'm so full of Thank you so much for watching for loving all our videos so much and we will be back with another part of this video very very soon. Stay tuned guys. Bye.